In SketchUp 3D for web, we can use 3D Warehouse to import or export 3D models. So we can add 3D elements made by other users. You can find the warehouse here on the right side menu. You can click those arrows to see names of each category. Right now I need 3D Warehouse. That's the fourth option on the list. It will give you this pop-up window. It will need to connect to the server where you can do a search. You can search with text or with picture or simply scroll down to browse. So if I type tree and hit enter, I will see different tree models. You can see how large the model is. We got 1.4 megabytes and how many triangles. So we don't want to kind of overload a simple project with very complex 3D object from the warehouse, that's for sure. As you may notice, there are four categories. We got models, catalogs, collections, and materials. So you can change that at the top and then browse for the element you need. If you see there's only one triangle, that's simply a bitmap, a simple 2D bitmap. All right, so as you can see, it's a huge difference here. This tree over here, we got over 200,000 triangles, but this one on the right is only 13, 14,000 triangles, all right? So you must pay attention to that value as well. And if you are happy with the tree you found, click here, the download icon. It may take a moment to download the element and you will get it stick to your mouse cursor. You can place it and then you can apply scale. Select the scale tool so you can scale it up and down to match your model, right? You want to scale it up and down to match. And of course, you can go back to the move tool again, click on it once, move it around and click again to reconfirm the new position. All right, so that's how you can load ready to use 3D models from 3D Warehouse. It's here on the right side. I hope this was helpful. See you in the next one.